Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are laser-focused on one thing, as their lucrative Netflix deal may be coming to a close, an expert claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex made a surprise appearance at the Bob Marley, One Love premiere in Jamaica on Tuesday night. Royal commentator, Kinsey Schofield, claimed that the couple may have attended the event to court rival streaming service Paramount. As Meghan and Harry continue to try to make it in Hollywood, Schofield said, the Markles are likely laser-focused on the fact that their Netflix contract is expiring in early 2025 and Paramount. Nickelodeon might be a good home for the Netflix-cancelled Pearl, Meghan's animated passion project. She added, sources at the Daily Mail say it was Paramount CEO that extended the offer for Harry and Meghan's Jamaica visit. The couple stepped down as working members of the royal family in 2020 and moved to Montecito, California with their children. Since then, the couple's rift with the royal family has grown with the release of several projects, detailing their split from the firm, including the much-watched docuseries Harry and Meghan that detailed the couple's relationship, marriage and eventual split from the royal family. In 2023, Prince Harry released his controversial memoir Spare. Harry's Invictus Games took place in Germany and rumors buzzed about Meghan, possibly restarting her lifestyle blog, The Tig. They also signed contracts with streaming giant Spotify and Netflix. But last year the deal with the former was mutually ended, after just one season of Meghan Markle's podcast archetypes debuted. Schofield said, I wonder if photos on the red carpet with the CEO of Paramount Pictures means their future at Netflix is in jeopardy. They have not walked any Netflix red carpets to promote any of the streaming platform's other projects. A streaming platform that has paid them a significant amount of money, their contract is expected to end in early 2025.